If we need the help, take the help. But if we really don't need the help, don't take the help. The CARES Act got signed in, and now the news is all about uh, understanding what's in that act. And one of the caveats in that act is potential forbearance. And so anybody with a home or with a mortgage is able to potentially avoid paying their mortgage for a certain duration, call it possibly up to six months. In doing so, with forbearance, those missed payments will be stacked on the end of their loan. I, I love it. I own rental property, and if I had one of my renters who could not make their rental payment, I would understand and try to help them to the best of my ability. But then there comes the stance of the people who can make the payment but see an opportunity to benefit themselves but not really the greater good of everyone because each and every one of us is going to flip this bill to help everyone else. And you know what? I'm all for that as long as we can all stand up with integrity and take the help we need and fight as hard as we can to avoid putting any more stress on all our other fellow Americans by milking the U.S. government for dollars. Because at the end of the day, sure, the government's giving away money, but it's our money. And sure, who's going to pay the price? We're going to pay the price. Each and every single one of us. So let's have respect for each other. Take the help if you need it. I'm all here and I'm all for it. But don't abuse the system. Don't take advantage of your fellow Americans.